game with big bucks and whammies is back. Bigger and better than ever. It's time to play whammy. The all new Press Your Luck. And now, please welcome our host, Todd Nugent. Thank you very much and thank you, Gary Kroger. Hi, folks. Welcome to Whammy, the all new Press Your Luck, where you can spin your way to big bucks and some great prizes, too. Right now, let's meet today's play. Hi, I'm David, and I don't like working, so I need to make money so I can be lazy. Hi, my name is Kelly. I'm buying a house. Show me the money! I am broke. I quit my job last week, so I need to win everything. Everything. All right, players, welcome. Welcome. Are you ready to press your luck here? Okay. Let's get things going here. You've each got $1,000 to start things off with. Now, you can add to that by taking a chance on our big board that you see behind me here. It's got hundreds of thousands of dollars of cash prizes loaded on it. And each time you spin, you can add to your total by landing on a square containing a cash value or a prize. This is how it works, right? Stop! A sewing machine. There you go. For $499. But you have to be careful of the dreaded whammy. Land on a whammy, he'll come out here and take all your cash, all your prizes, and knock you out for the rest of the round. You don't want that. Now, the strategy in this round is to take as many spins as you dare to take without hitting the whammy. And you can freeze at any time if you're afraid of the whammy or if you think you've already earned enough to win the round. Remember, the player in the lead at the end of this round has a big advantage in our final round. And the player in the lead at the end of the game is the winner, and the only one who gets to keep the cash and the prizes that they've earned. All right. Now we did ourselves a little drawing backstage to determine who would go first here. David, that's you. Start you off with a thousand dollars. Let's see what you can add to that right now. Put the big board in motion. Good luck. Right. See that stereo system? No whammy, no whammy. Stop. Stop in a karaoke system worth three hundred seventy-nine dollars, David. I see some singing in your future here, Kelly. You've got a thousand dollars to get going here. Let's see what you can add to that. The board is yours. Stop at one thousand dollars, Kelly. Good way to start off the day, isn't it? Two thousand dollars here in first place now. And Brooke, here we come to you. Here's your first spin. Good luck. Stop at a chauffeur limousine for a day worth five hundred fifty dollars. You're going to be riding in style. Now, here's the thing. We've gone down the line successfully. We're going to make things more interesting for you by putting more whammies up on the board. And here they come. All right, we'll get back to you, David. You're in third place, $1,379. Would you like to freeze there, or would you like to press your luck? I've got to press my luck. Okay. All right. I'm the money. I need the big bucks. And stop. Stop it. Pick it up. Light up the board. Maybe a CD player, a sewing machine, GPS watch, maybe a sunset dinner cruise, a spa, video collection, golf lessons, a personal chef, how about that, a CD cabinet, or a portable CD player. What's your choice, David? What would you like? I'm going to have to go with the sunset dinner cruise. You want that sunset dinner cruise? You've got it. That's worth $180 for you. Brings you up to $1,559. You'll enjoy that. Kelly, down to you, still in second place with $2,000. Freeze there and press your luck. I want to press my luck. Okay, here we go. Stop at a stereo system worth $300. $2,300 is where you are now. Kelly's still in first place, and we move on down the line to Brooke. $1,550, third place. Freeze and press your luck. Here we go. Okay. Stop it! His and her rollerblades, they are worth $320. All right, another trip down the line. Six spins no, so far and no money yet. Good job, baby. Good job. Now we have to add more money to the board, though. You see, that's just the way it works around here. And we come back to you, David. What would you like to do? Freeze or press your luck? Uh, I'm a gambler by nature. He's a gambler man. All right. Whammy. Whammy. You can get this mean green burner machine for one easy payment of all your money. There you go. 
there, Dave, and wiped you out not only money-wise, but also knocked you right out of the first round here. So that means it's between Kelly and Brooke. Kelly, we come to you in first place with $2,300. If you freeze with that, you'll take that into the final round with you if you'd like to press your luck. Okay. All right. $2,800 for you now, Kelly. Brooke, how about it? $1,870. What would you like to do? I need to press my luck. Okay. <laughs> Lessons. There were three hundred seventy-five dollars. Gives you two thousand two hundred forty-five. And yes, we're adding more whammies to the board now. We made it down the line. We lost David that trip, so it's just between Kelly and Brooke. Kelly still in first place, twenty-eight hundred dollars. How? 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 All right, she's picking that new house. Here we go. Pressing her luck. Now the cookware for the house. Yep. Worth five hundred dollars, up to thirty-three hundred dollars now, Kelly and Brooke. Down to you once again. Two thousand two hundred forty-five dollars. What would I you like to, to do? Again. Okay, here she goes. Stop at a full spa treatment worth three hundred forty-five dollars, ladies. How about it? Three thousand three hundred dollars for you, Kelly. We're back to you. Lots of whammies up there, making it my day. Not bad. That's worth two hundred fifty dollars. We're taking care of the house here, aren't you, yes, Kelly? Yes, I am. All right, Brooke. How about it? Two thousand five ninety. They're going. Back to the Stop and a mega CD player worth two hundred thirty dollars brings you up to two thousand eight hundred twenty dollars. Kelly, Brooke, you are both whammy free so far. Kelly, if you freeze here, you'll take that into the final round with you, or you can press your luck and try to get some more stuff for the house. What would you like to do? Go with me. I'm going for it. I'm going for it. All right. Mm. Oh, whammy. And I'd like to thank my agent. Me. But most of all, Kelly, you're out of this round. You're That's down to zero. Okay. Brooke, it's all about you. You're all alone here. $2,820. What would you like to do? Freeze or press your luck? You're going to freeze. Okay. Consider yourself frozen. At the end of round one, David's at zero with the whammy. Kelly's at zero also with the whammy. And Brooke's at $2,820. She'll have the advantage of the final round. And when we come back, you'll have the advantage of our question round. Stay right there. <laughs> Welcome back to Wabbing the All New Fresh for Luck. Good to have you here, players. All right, what we're going to do now is give you a chance to earn some spins here for the final round of the game. Of course, the more spins you earn, the better chance you'll have to win. This is how this round works. I'm going to ask you a question. And the first player that buys in gets to answer that question. That answer then becomes one of three choices for the remaining two players. A correct buzzing answer here gets you three spins. A correct multiple choice answer gets you one spin. Are you ready? Okay. There we go. Players, your first question. In what profession do members take the Hippocratic Oath? Kelly. Medical. Is it medical, police officers, or judges? I'm going to say judges. I'm going to say judges. It's actually medical. Doctors take the Hippocratic Oath. Yes, they do. David, you stay at zero. Nothing for you. Kelly, we'll give you three for that one. And Brooke, you stay at zero as well. Here comes the next question. Taking its name from the French words meaning Green Mountain, which state is well known for its maple syrup? Kelly, again. Yeah. Vermont. Is it Vermont? Montana? Or is it Michigan? David? It's Vermont. Vermont. Brooke? Vermont. Indeed, it is Vermont. Very nice. Can't beat that good old maple syrup. David, you pick up a spin there. You're at one. Kelly, you get three more for that. You're now six. And Brooke, you get one there, too. All right. Which Thelma and Louise co-star is also currently a member of Mensa? Out of time, I'll give you three choices here. Is it Gina Davis? Is it Susan Sarandon? Or is it Brad Pitt? David? I'm going to go ahead and guess Gina Davis. You did, Kelly? Susan Sarandon. 
Good. Susan Sarandon. No. Gina Davis. It is Gina Davis. Gina, very nice. You pick up another spin here at two. I know you see her at all the meetings, right? Yeah, sure. Tell you <laughs> say it's six, but you say it what? Here comes your next question. This one is a whammy flashback. 10, 15, or 20 years ago. Tammy Faye files for divorce from Jim Baker. Johnny Carson ends his hosting reign on The Tonight Show. The Toronto Blue Jays win the World Series for the first time. How many years ago did these events happen? 10, 15, or 20? Look. How about 10? How about 10? 15, David? I'm going to go in 15. Kelly? 15. Nope, it was 10 years ago. 10 years ago that happened. David stays at 2. Kelly stays at 6. And Brooke, who I'm assuming is probably a big Toronto Blue Jays fan, gets straight for that. There you go. You're at four now. And here comes the final question. Thousand Island Dressing actually got its name after a region in what country? Outside, your three choices. Was it France, United States, or Russia? David? I'm going to guess Russia. Okay. I'm going Russia. Brooke? Russia. The United States. The good old US of A. We get all the credit for that one. All right. It's Yay. David, you've got two spins. Kelly, you have six. And Brooke, you have four. Take them into the final round. And when we come back, over $100,000 looking for a home. Where will it go? Stay right there and find out. Luck players, over $100,000 of cash prizes up there on that board. And like always, a few whammies, so please do be careful because if you hit a whammy, they're going to grab all your cash and you'll get flat broke. If you hit four whammies, then you're eliminated from the game. So David, be careful. Kelly, be careful. Broke your whammy free. And as if that weren't enough for you, the big board now features some double whammy. Double whammies not only take all your money, they come out here and mess with you. And in this round, it's some strategy because you can now pass the remaining spins to, the, uh, to uh, your opponent who's in the lead here in hopes that they're going to hit a whammy. Now, the leader must take the spins out of the pass to him. And please do remember that only the player is in the lead at the end of the game gets to take home all the cash and all those boxes. All right? All right. Brooke, you're in the lead with $2,820. You will go last in this round. That's always a good thing. Now, we go to the player with the least amount of money. David Kelly, you're tied. So, we will go to the player with the least amount of spins. And my buddy David, that's you, zero dollars. One whammy, two spins. Would you like to take one now? We'll show in the final round. Yeah. Here we go. All right. I'm going to keep that box. Put me back in the morning. No whammy, no whammy, no whammy. Stop. Stop it. Two thousand dollars or lose a whammy. Which would you like? The money or get rid of the whammy? I'll take the money. You've Wait. got the money. Two thousand dollars, David. Right. Very nice. One more spin to go. Would you like to press your luck? Or gotta pass? get back in the line. Okay. Big money, big money. No whammies, no whammies, man. Stop. Stop. Three thousand. Two spins into it. You find yourself in first place with five thousand dollars. You still have one spin. Press your luck or pass. I'm gonna pass it. Pass. pass to Brooke. All right. In that case, the spin comes to you, Brooke. You'll have to take that spin a little bit later on. But right now, we're focusing our attention on Miss Kelly here, who wants to stock that new house. Yes, I do. You have zero dollars, but you do have six spins. Would you like to take your first spin? I want to take a spin. Okay. Show me the money! Show me the money! Show me the money! Show me the money! Stop it! A double whammy! <laughs> That's your second way of the game. You're down to okay, zero dollars. Actually, you're still at uh, yeah. zero. You do have five spins, though, so it's certainly not over for you. Let's get the ball in motion, okay? Stop! Stop at soccer table. That's right at $899. You've got four spins. Pass them or press your luck. Ping pong action. You knew what was <laughs> happening there, didn't you? I, I knew it was coming. Yeah, I can see you cringe. 
All right, Kelly, bad news. That's your third whammy. One more, and uh, you're going to be out of the game. You have $0, but you do have three spins here. So if you pass them, they will go to David. Or if you press your luck, the board's waiting for you. What would you like to do? Okay. Stop it, surround sound. Audio system worth $1,000. Two more spins, Kelly. Lots of squares up there that can get you right back into the game, back into the lead, even. Would you like to uh, take another spin? All right. Big money, big money, big money, big money, big money. Stop at a casino Ooh. into a vacation worth $1,240. $2,240 is where you are now, Kelly. You have one more spin. If you hit one more whammy, you're out of the game, or you can press your luck here. What would you like to do, press it or pass? Press your luck or press pass? Luck. Okay, here we go. Big money, big money, big money, big money. That's it. Kelly, unfortunately, that's your fourth whammy. Knocks you out of the game, and you are such a good sport. We're going to take a little break when we come back. It'll be all about Brooks. Four spins earned one. She will have to take after this. All right, welcome back. Before the break, poor Kelly's taking quite a beating here. Her fourth whammy, she's out of the game. But Damn. you look great with the whole grass. Yeah, and the I feel great. Ball look. Okay. <laughs> Brooke, it's all about you. We haven't heard from you this round. You have $2,820, four spins in your earned column. One that was passed to you from David that you must take that spin. So okay. let's go ahead and do that now. Good luck to you. All right. All right. All right. Stop at $1,100. You can send a thank you card to David a little bit later on. Now you've got four spins to play with. You can do with those whatever you like. Pass them or press your luck. I have pressed my luck. Okay. Five thousand. Dollars and a spin, bro. You're now at eight thousand nine hundred twenty dollars. Still four spins. If you pass them, they go to David. He must take them and avoid the whammy. Or you can press your luck. Try to add your total a little bit here. What would you like to do? Okay. Four thousand. $12,920. You still have four spins. What would you like to do? Pass or press your luck? You have yet to hit a whammy, Brooke. What would you like to do? Okay. Oh my God. You know, I'm going to pass them. You're going to pass them. Good. Pass. Right. Hey, Those spins come to you, David. You have $5,000, almost $8,000 behind Brooke. Four spins you have to take. Here comes your first. Good luck. Okay, put me back in the lead. I need to do some. No whammy, no whammy. Stop. Stop at a TV and VCR worth $680. $5,680 is where you are now. Still three spins to go, David. Here comes your next. One. No whammy. Big buck. No whammy. No whammy. Stop. Stop at $1,100. $6,780, David. You are $6,140 behind Brooke. You still have two spins. Let's go to the board. Here comes the No whammy. No whammy. Don't be good, Stop. Oh. Second whammy, you are down to zero. We're going to take that last spin out of your pass column, put it in your earned column. You have zero dollars. Now, you can use that on the board. Press your luck. Try and find something to get you another spin so you can stay alive here. If you pass it, it will go to Brooke, and you can keep your fingers crossed, hope she whammies. What would you like to do? I can't kill her like that. I'm going to give it a shot. You're going to press your luck. All right. You need something to give you another right. spin, David. I need an extra spin. Stop. Stop at $550. No. That's not enough. Look, you did it. $12,920. It was all about passing the spin. Here's Jerry Kroger to tell you what you got. How about a Technic Mega CD player? Technic puts hours of digital music at your fingertips with the Mega CD Changer with a 110 disc capacity and CD tech 
Baxter from Techniques, the Science of Sound. And his her roller blades. There's more a full spa treatment. How about some skydiving lessons? And a chauffeur limousine for a day. You put that together with your $11,100 in cash, your grand total is $12,920. Wow. wow. Sounds like you're going to be a busy lady coming up. Great, great job. Kelly, thank you so much. Ladies, who's to know? The way we speak out and get you. Folks, thank you so much for joining us. Make sure you're here next time for Whammy. The all-new Fresh Your Luck. It's a mess back here. Bye-bye. We'll see you next time.